today I'm going to talk about how we can dye um, matter root scarf, which is all natural dyes from matter root, um, and put imprints on that, which is um, going to be also a darker color of pink. For that project, we need, obviously, silk scarf prepared and dyed. Um, we need some leaves, which we're going to imprint. It's, um, I choose some maple um, maple leaves because they really um, full of tannins. Uh, very important to cut off um, the part of this stem because there's a lot of tannins there. When you're using uh, flowers, don't put the whole thing on the scarf, but um, use some parts of it. Just snip small flowers off the stem because that, as usual, stem has a lot of uh, tannin in them. Also, uh, very good for echo printing are uh, rose leaves. Again, snip it right where the, you know, where the less of the stem will be using. And also, peony's leaves are beautiful in shape and when treated with some matter root solution, it is beautiful in prints. Contrager leaves are pretty good too and Japanese um, maple tree leaves. And I soak them in the matter root solution. Actually, this is like electric warmer, so it's, it's, it's not boiled, but it's, it's keep it in warm temperature. So let the natural dye soak better into leaves. Um, you also need some gloves, because we'll be, when we're placing all the sleeves on the scarf, we have to take excess of um, dye and water from it. Um, so um, paper towels for the same reason, plastic bag to line up, um, hopefully on the whole length of your scarf on the table. And um, the tape for securing our bundle. And then you have two options for um, rolling your fabric on either hose, which is more flexible and then you can bend it and easy fit to any kind of um, part with um, simple uh, steamer, which you can put on the bottom of your pot. Or if you have a bigger um, kind of um, uh, steaming uh, device <laughs> so you can use um, you know this kind of uh, pipe for rolling the fabric on it um, with that I will be using a bigger pot which is in this case fish poacher um, if you have something longer which can fit your um, you know bundle that's okay too So now we're going to um, lay the leaves um, and before laying them on the silk scarf, we're going to dry them with a paper towel. So we're taking all the axes of um, water and then placing them randomly face and um, up and face down. Um, it's nice also to combine um, bigger leaves with a smaller one as well with the uh, small flowers. will be um, making a roll with your scarf. So we're gonna place um, another piece of plastic on top and you see we have some on the bottom. And we're gonna roll it on this plastic pipe and make a very tight roll. And making sure the 
was breaking the fabric of So now we're going to um, secure our bundle with some tape. Um, going to the whole length of your tube or um, if you're using hose, that's a possibility too. After securing our bundle, we're gonna place it if we use the plastic pipe into the um, fish poacher. Also, you have an option to um, roll it on the hose and then fold the hose and place it in any size of pot you have on the steamer. And up to two hours steaming your bundle, um, making sure your bundle cool off fully and then you can open it. 